Okay, this is how I prepare my venison for canning. As you can see this stuff here, you don't want none of this in your in your jars. So what I do is take and flip it over. I'm using just a cheap Walmart fillet knife and just start cut it off. Just like that. So yeah, I missed a couple spots, but I'll take them off in the in the other process. Okay, and then what I do is this is a roast out of the hind quarter. I just take and cut me off a good size chunk of it, about like that. Get it down here like this, and then what I do is I go right around the edges, trimming that off. With this flay knife, you can really trim it close to the edge. So you don't lose any meat that you want to can. Okay, well, I don't really lose it anyway because I throw it in the hamburger pile. There you've got a nice, clean chunk of meat. And... Whenever you're canning meat, it's important to remember that you're going to get out of it what you put into it. So what that means is if you're going to can the scraps, then that's what you're going to get. So it, the, the more time you spend cleaning this meat, and by the way, this is the deer that I shot on Sunday. We just boned it out. It's a warm out. We didn't do much with it. We boned it out and and uh, cut these roasts and stuff off the hind quarters, and basically bagged it up and put it in the freezer. And I took it out last night and thawed it. Now I have found that this stuff will. Uh, cuts a lot better and it doesn't dull your knife as bad if it's a little bit frozen and there you have it the more time you spend cleaning this stuff up the better off you are and I use a lot of these cheap knives they're they're not they're not hard to sharpen if you know a few little secrets. This knife here is the one I use to cut the hogs up. It's probably the cheapest knife you could buy. I think I maybe gave $20 for two of them. But what I did was I took a chainsaw file like this one and just like you'd use a steel, I reprofiled it a little bit. So it put a different edge on there, and now it's a usable knife. Of course, my son says I could sharpen a chunk of steel and make it cut, but that's something, a different video.